how to mount an NFS share in Linux with Ansible, I'm going to show you in a live demo with some simple Ansible code. I'm Luca Burton and welcome in today's episode of Ansible Pilot. Today we are talking about Ansible module mount. The full name is ansible.posix.mount, which means that is part of a collection of module ansible.posix to interact with POSIX platform. The purpose of the module is to control active and configured mount points. For Windows, use the community.windows.win underscore mapped underscore drive module instead. Parameters This module has many parameters to perform any task. The only required are path and state. The parameter path specifies the path of the mount point, for example, MNT. The parameter state allow us to verify a specific state of the mount point. The option mounted, unmounted and remounted changes the device status. The present and absent option only changed the ATC FSTAB file. The SRC parameter specify the device or network volume for NFS or SMB CFS. The FS type parameter specify the file system type, so for example X4, XFS, ISO 9000, etc., NFS, CFS, etc. The OPTS parameter allow us to specify some mount option that vary for each file system type. Demo. Let's jump in a real life Ansible playbook to mount an NFS share. Are you ready? Let's have fun! Welcome to my editor. I will show you one simple playbook to mount an NFS share in Linux. First of all, let's begin our play with a name mount module demo that is going to target hosts all here we are and we need a root power so become true then what else let's define some variable that can be useful and you can customize to your use case my nfs will be the path of the NFS server and NFS share. In my case, local IP slash NFS slash share. Then what else? A mount point on my Linux target machine. In my case, uh, will be slash share. Here we are. What else? Some permission. This depends by the NFS server, in my case I set it up to 0777 so all users can read and write from the share. Some option for the mount point, so in my case RW for read and write and sync because I would like to synchronize the reading and writing between the server. There are plenty of it, you just need to read the manual. So, task list, we are expecting three tasks. First, uh, yeah, verify that uh, the utility are going to be present. Let's start uh, with a uh, Red Hat like system. So, we need a YAM module that will be under ansible.builtin.yam. We need two packages, so the name will be a list 
nfs-utils and I would like to use NFS version 4, so NFS4-ACL-Tools. State will be obviously present on the target machine and let me also condition this module with when using the internal variable ansible slash os slash family no ansible underscore os underscore family equal equal to red hat so this setup is going to run only on a that like system then second step will be to check if the mount point is exist on the target machine so let's name accordingly I'm going to use module file and ansible.builtin.file here we go so the path will be the value of man point variable here we are so the value of man point let's use parentheses accordingly for the value then the state will be a directory because we would like to create a directory if not present let me also define the mode so the value of permission in my case 077 here we are and uh, also let me add the owner that will be root and the group that is going to be root of this directory so we define a quite specific mount point so first step finally we can mount our nfs share so mm, let's name mount network share i'm going to use module mount under ansible.posix collection so ansible.posix.mount uh, first parameter is src in my case will be the value of my nfs variable here we are and we would like to mount this uh, nfs under the path value of mount point here we are mm, let me define some other parameter fs type will be nfs and what else do we need oh yes options opts will be the value of my opts here we are okay state will be mounted because we would like to use this stuff don't we so three step set up the utility check the mount point and mount the nfs share but this is going to work only for red hat like system you see also the variable that can help us to customize so let me add another step for debian like system so will be named utility present debian like and we are going to use apt module and ansible.builtin.apt uh, we need uh, two packages so under the name list the nfs utility and nfs 4 dash acl tools but uh, in debian like nfs utils is called nfs common fantastic state will be also present but the condition will be when ansible underscore os underscore family equal equal debian so here we are four wonderful step to install the needed packages set up the mount point directory and at the end mount the nfs share in a linux workstation simple playbook few line of code straightforward and uh, you will have a fun to customize with your actual need only changing the value of a variable in the beginning welcome to my console let me first of all connect 
to my demo machine using SSH, DevOps as a user, and on my case is demo.example.com. Let me switch to root with sudo su command. This machine is a Red Hat like, so let me cut the slash etc Red Hat dash release. Is a Red Hat Enterprise Linux version 8, as you can see. So, first step, let me verify the package if it's installed or not with yam list nfh dash utils. We see that it is available, which means not yet installed on this system. Let me also try to list the available NFS uh, share on my target host with show mount dash dash exports and the IP address. And this command is not found because it's part of a package. Let me list the content or slash share and this mount point doesn't exist. Double check, let's cut etc fs tab. There is only the root, file system, and the swap. So, no NFS. As we can see also in the mount, there is uh, all the system stuff, but not the NFS that we're expecting. So, this is a clean machine. Let me exit from root, exit from DevOps, and let me execute my playbook. Ansible dash playbook. Dash e my inventory file, virtual machine demo inventory, and then the path of my playbook. Mount NFS, here we are. We are, we are expecting some changed status on the target machine, and that is going to take some time depending on the performance of your virtual machine and also the network usage. In my case, very fast, free change of status, so all action were performed. Successfully install the package, create the mount point, and set up the NFS. Let me execute again the playbook to show you the hidden potency of this script. And we have a 4 OK status, which means that was successfully and no more action executed. Let me verify manually via SSH DevOps as demoexample.com. Let's switch again to root and start with yam list NFS utils. This time the result will be not available, but uh, I'm expecting installed. Here we are. The package is successfully installed. So we can execute the show mount dash dash exports and the local IP on my NFS server that is going to list the all available NFS share. In my case only one slash NFS share from the local IP. So let me verify the man point if it's correctly installed. As you can see from the content of ATC FS tab, there is one more line with the NFS share. Let me verify if is already mounted with mount and boom, last line is related to NFS for share. So it is. Let me list the content of share and this time the directory exists with one file inside. Let me create one not with touch, let me use echo, so with some test, with some text, test inside from uh, in slash share slash test two dot txt. So we verify that we can write let me list again, and there is also test to file, as you can see. Let me cut to verify that we can read actually this file. The previous is empty file, so I'm not going to <laughs> open for you. With uh, df, we can verify the space, and we can see that we have a 60 gigabyte NFS volume 
available under the shared directory. This space it adds to our Linux machine on top of our internal space that is also 70 GB. So good job Hansible, he set up all the need, all the configuration file and mounted the device. Now it's ready to use. Now you know how to mount an NFS share in Linux with Ansible. If you liked this video, give me a thumbs up and see us for the next Ansible Pilot lesson. Have a great day! This video is part of our Ansible automation program. Sign up today on www.ansiblepilot.com for uninterrupted exclusive video and so much fun!